extended to the stained glass by the pool. Okay. So I will instruct the person That's in charge. Got a very big deal, including moving the grand piano. Got it. So what about um, all your books, Bob? The books have to, you know, you know, there's a phenomenon. There's another guy that comes and works for me. He looks like you. Okay. And he could, he could be you. <laughs> and, and I can confuse him, the two of you. Okay. How about so Chris? A, How about, isn't Chris um, the other person? He's a Chinese guy. Okay. What about Chris? Chris comes at night. Does he? Sometimes he does. Sometimes he doesn't. But... Should I contact uh, Chris to coordinate with him, with, with the manager, to get the truck, to move all the, the paintings? Should. No, but, but the, the point is, I'm here now. Okay. Now I want to talk to whoever, listen to me now, whoever is in charge now, who's the main person sure. on this property. Okay. It could be a woman, it could be a guy. Okay. Uh, it could be the general manager of all of the entire uh, uh, complex. Uh, I'm just trying to give you all the exceptions okay. to looking for the manager because there probably is no manager. Okay. What about this pig? Huh? How about the pig? Do we want the pig moved? Oh, absolutely. Okay. So we got to move I the table. I may even take the. I may even take the uh, the ceiling lighting. Okay. I gave you that lighting a long time ago, the track lighting. But you want the Rembrandt taken down. That's a, that's a big undertaking, Bob. Did you ever own a, a, a... Well, the other guy that looks like you told me he gave it to me. Yeah, he, he has a lighting, a lighting company, yeah. He told me he owned a lighting company. Okay. But he was actually you. Yes, it's me. Did you pay me $12,000? To do a, your private party here? No, $24,000 in 2006. Did you pay me that money? Yes. For my birthday party, yes. Well, I've got you confused with another person. <laughs> okay, okay, Bob. What day, what's today, Bob? Today is, you know what today is, Bob? Sunday. No. The newspaper I read. Actually, it's, um, it's in July. We're July 2nd, 2020 today. And you just turned 91 in May 6th. See, you're better than I am in terms of memory. What, what city are we in, Bob? Are we in right now? What city is this? I've got the paper right here. Okay, remember, no cheating. What city are we in? What city? Is it? We're, in we're in San Francisco. Where were you born? I was born in Chicago, Illinois. Okay, how come you came out to San Francisco? From uh, I came out. So you're testing me, but I'll pass the test. Will okay. You? Why did I come to San Francisco? Yes, Bob. Because of Henry J. Kaiser to write speeches for his steel mill. Oh, wow. Okay. And then we just went to Kaiser for your first checkup in a long time during, yes, two days ago, Bob. Yeah. And so you were, you've you been with Kaiser for, is it through Kaiser Aluminum? He built Kaiser? Do you remember? What? Okay. How about this, Bob? What's the name of your advertising company in San Francisco? I had two of them here. Okay, what's the first one? Pritikin and, e and Eglin. Okay. Pritikin and Eglin Advertising. Okay. And the other one is, is, is Gibbons, Jerry Gibbons. Gib Pritikin and Gibbons. What was your most famous campaign, Bob, advertising in San Francisco Bay well, Area? In San Francisco, the most famous one was Folgers Coffee. Folgers, okay. Yeah, you've done many. You've done many advertisements for San Francisco. Okay, what is your favorite thing to do, Bob? I know what your favorite food is. Well, you know, I love you very much because you're a fabulous guy. But uh, and, and, but you can test me and I'll pass your <laughs> test. I, I guarantee you. I know, Bob. You're too short, Bob. For, for, but, for, but, for, 80, for 85, Bob, you're pretty good. But here's my point. Yes. In, unless I and... Unless Chris is here, and definitely me too, mm -hmm. when this when this occurs, yes, I have to know. I and I want. I'm, it's very important. Whoever you talk to, and I'll talk to him too. I want his phone number and name. Okay. Because we've got to follow up on this. This is not a. This is a very major thing. 
I have discovered because of, of me being put in that bathroom. Okay. So I now, know this let me ask you this, Bob. Ago. How does it feel that you, you were not tested positive for coronavirus from Dr. Fellows? That is not resolved yet. Not resolved yet? Okay. I'll tell you something else. I didn't, I thought, I didn't know that was a man. Dr. Fellows? Yeah. Apparently, it's because when I saw him yesterday, yes. he was a woman. No. Yes. Dr. Fellows is a woman? Yeah, I, I made a mistake referring to him as a woman. I think, I think Dr. Fellows is a man, but I think the woman was the, um, she is the outpatient uh, care nurse. To help you with your blood test, I think you might have confusion. I'm not confused because I called I called huh. him, him or her, <laughs> Doctor Fellows, and that was the same one. Oh wow! So that's why I needed your undivided attention. There could be all kinds of it and the okay. that you have to deal with. That I, if I'm not here when the murderers are here, yes, and he, whoever I talk to, has. I got to have to have the name and phone number and phone number because I want this to start immediately. All of these artwork. You know, oh yeah. It has to, the cabinets. You see the cabinets there? Yes, I saw that. All that, even the stained glass. And and the contents have to be packed. What about the waterfall here, Bob? The what? The waterfall. The the waterfall. Where would you like to have that move to? The water fountain. Yes, the water fountain. Outdoor fountain. Right there. Oh, that's part of the art. Yeah. It has to be taken to my house. Would, would you want that in your house? In your bedroom? In the I living room? I don't know where I'm on anything yet. Okay. We got a lot of stuff here, Bob, to take care of. This is a big, this is a big undertaking. And and I want you to witness my meeting with the guy. Okay. And, I, and then I want you to be the guy to follow up on it. Roger. Okay. But I want him to meet you. Okay. Or he or she. Whoever, what's the key here? Whoever is the key main person right now as I sit here. Okay. I'm going to wait here for you to come back who that person is. Okay. And, and tell me, his, uh, tell me his or her name. Uh, okay, I'll do that. Let me get him right now, Bob. Okay. He or she, and, and they're going to be confused. And here's what, what they say, what is this nature? Why, who is this person? Don't go into the detail. Say it's extremely important. What well, if they ask who it is? What well, if they ask you, who, who when, is this? When they, when they come here, I'll ask them who they are. You don't want me to tell them who you are? No. Okay. Oh, okay. tell them it's, it's, no, here's what I want you to tell them. Okay. Say it's extremely important. Okay. And we're dealing with, uh, with probably, oh, Close to a million dollars. Okay. The subject is close to a million dollars. Okay. All right, Bob. We'll go. Roger it out.